Hey, good morning and welcome back. We're in the Gospel of Luke, chapter 6, verse 41 and 42 is our reading today. Let's just look at it. And why do you look at the speck in your brother's eye, but do not perceive the plank in your own eye? Or how can you say to your brother, Brother, let me remove the speck that is in your eye, when you yourself do not see the plank that is in your own eye? Hypocrite, first remove the plank from your own eye, and then you will see clearly to remove the speck that is in your brother's eye. So this is a famous saying, I know you've heard it before, and it's it's sort of a comical picture again, another kind of, you know, you 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 want to remove that little speck in that person's eye, wait, when you've got a big plank, you know, a big stick of wood, a giant piece of wood sticking out of your eye, and Jesus is sort of making this, this absurd picture. But it is kind of an absurd thing when, when people are going around and, you know, telling people, telling people what, what they should do. A friend of mine just told me today, at church when he was in the military. He uh, he was going down the street and uh, he, he just, at, at random, he kind of threw a snowball. And across the street, he didn't realize it, but there was a commanding officer and he said, soldier. And he said, yes, sir. And he said, pick up that, pick up that piece of trash you put on the ground. Well, it turned out it wasn't a piece of trash. It was just a snowball. And so the officer was kind of embarrassed, but here's the officer kind of pulling rank on this guy and kind of putting his officerness ahead. But but the joke was on him, right? He, he had just thrown a snowball. He wasn't trying to, to prank anybody, but he was throwing his weight around. And sometimes when people throw their weight around, look, I can help you solve this. I can fix this for you. Let me solve and fix everything. And yet, meanwhile, they've got a big, a big old board sticking out of their own eye. Jesus is telling us not, not to be hypocrites. Hypocrite's an old Greek word that means mask wearer. It means to wear over one's face. And so... Um, now, he does say the last piece here. Notice that he said, you know, make sure you don't have a speck in your eye, and then you will see clearly to remove the speck in someone else, you know, the item in someone else's eye. So, so let's be careful. God does want us to be able to help each other, but from a, from a, a genderless basis, right, from a, without a basis of pride or I'm better than you, we want to just help each other, and we should be glad when we receive the help of others who are serving the Lord Jesus and are therefore helping us, helping us on, on the basis of being one of his disciples. Let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, thank you that we don't need to be hypocrites. We don't need to be mask wearers. Yes, there's a lot of that in the world, but Lord, help us to be true. And Lord, help us so that we'll know exactly how we can be a blessing to others. Sometimes we can help them see things that they themselves do not see. So be our leader, and thank you for hearing our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. Hey, friend. Uh, There's going to be a lot better eyesight when we all follow the plan of Jesus. God's blessing be upon you this day.